Don't worry. We're only staying here for a little while. I don't like it here. I want to go home. I know. Salute, Onko. I did as you asked. And quickly, too. Ben fatto. Now, let's teach you how to fight. No. As I said, we are leaving. Ezio, you barely held your own against Vieri. You won't survive a week on the road. If you want to leave, so be it. But at least do so armed with the skills and knowledge necessary to defend yourself. If not for me, for your mother and sister. Fine. Ottimo. You can swing a sword to be sure, but offense alone will not carry a battle. You must survive long enough to strike. I will teach you how to dodge. You said my father was more than just a banker. Ah. No use dancing around it, I suppose. Your father. Was an assassin, Ezio. I told you before. My father was a paper <laughs> pusher. Difficult to believe. What is the list you carry? Do you think it's merely a catalog of debts? It holds the names of those responsible for your father's murder. you how to avoid your enemy's attacks. Now you'll learn how to turn them to your advantage. All this talk of assassins and Templars, it reeks of fantasy. Like something from an old parchment covered in arcane writing, perhaps? How did you know? You have... Father's blade. I think you can have the codex page you're holding as well. Codex. See, a guide to the inner world and to the order. Origin, purpose, and technique. Our three of you. Your father believed the codex to gain the power of secret. Something that would change the world. Perhaps it's why it is for him. Assassins, Templars, Codex pages. This is a lot to take in. Open your mind, it's Always remember, nothing is true, everything is permitted.
Hai paura! You're making fine progress, Ezio. Today I'm going to teach you how to position yourself in battle. Where you stand and how you move can make all the difference. Don't think I haven't seen you picking apart my library. I trust you believe me now? Yes. My father was an assassin. But why the need for such secrecy? Are you familiar with the Templars? One of several knightly orders formed during the Crusade. History teaches they were disbanded nearly 200 years ago in France. Only they weren't. They were pushed underground, where they continued a nefarious work. What work? The Templars seek dominion over man, and we, the assassins, are sworn to stand against them. Was Uberto one of them? Yes. And the other names on my father's list? Templars as well. <coughs> that means Vieri. Just like his father, Francesco. Likely the entire Pazzi family. Hey, this would explain many things. into your own. Thank you, uncle, for all you have given me. Your family. Such is my duty and my desire. I'm glad you had me stay. Good. You've reconsidered leaving. We sail for Spain in three days. But Nipote, I have given you these skills that you might be better prepared to strike against our enemies. And if they find me, I will. You want to leave Ezio? To throw away everything your father fought and died for? To deny your heritage? Fine! Come voi. Arrivederci e buona fortuna! Uncle, wait! Why is he so upset? How can he not be? Vieri's been harassing us ever since you first arrived. To be expected, I suppose. Given his heritage. Where is everyone? They ride for San Gimignano to slay that sn- Vieri di Pazzi, the youngest member of the second most notorious Florentine banking family, this kid knew how to burn right through his father's money. Outside of spending sprees involving weaponry, exotic animals and clothes, he was fiercely competitive. 
Vieri hosted races of all kinds, boating, horseback riding, running. All of them rigged, of course. And get this, if through some amazing stroke of luck he ever lost, he'd invite the winner's entire family over for a victory dinner and serve them a meal to die for. Vieri, I wish to join them. You'll find what you need at the stables. 